Greetings and welcome to episode 4 of my Empire Total War Darth Mod USA campaign and this my friends that we left it last time where we had Prussia Prussia my friends of all people deciding to declare war on us and also attack us here at Maine at Falmouth at, in Maine unbelievable my friends and they also have besieged our main trade port in New York I'm not going to sugarcoat this for you my friends at all we are in trouble because they really have thrown the absolute kitchen sink at us here as you can see here they have got grenadiers here they've got a uh, heavy cav well, lots of cannon um, but also bringing in their musketeers they're bringing in some of their finest troops now they they have just thrown everything at us here now these troops have already been fighting in Europe against their enemies in Europe my friends so they've thrown in their veterans here of many campaigns we're not going to shirk my friends we are not going to yield we are bankrupt at the moment as well because they are besieging New York so pretty much bankrupt so that is where it is laid on the table we are in some difficulty here but what I will not do my friends is yield I will not yield at all if I've got to I will send a an army to Prussia to take out one of their territories. That is how I feel about it at the moment, my friends, because we have com been completely backstabbed by the Prussians. They came completely out of the blue. The, the the British, I can understand, because we are, you know, we are uh, long-born enemies, as it were. The Spanish, I can understand that as well, because they have been long-standing sort of residents of this area, and they want to take all the territory for themselves. That I can understand up to a point. But Prussia, not a chance, my friends. I am not going to sit by and take this at all. So. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to deal with this army here. It's going to be tough, and it's going to be a vicious fight, my friends. Have absolutely no doubts about it. There's only one silver lining from this, and that is, unfortunately, the more men I lose, the lower my army upkeep bill will be, which means I will get a surplus at the end of next turn, which means I won't be banked anymore, only because some of my men have died. And I don't like having that attitude, my friends. But I've got to look at this practically. I l simply do not have enough money to keep these armies going unless some of these men sort of die in the field and I hate that I loathe having that that sort of view on things because you know these men are going to push me towards victory if we can take out this Prussian force but what I'm going to do first of all is I'm going to give Prussia a damn good kick in to let them know they don't just come here and take what they want and then walk away not a chance so we're going to be we're besieged but my friends, we're going to try and take this Prussian army out. Then we're going to try and sue for peace. And I'll throw a little bit at it. I'll try and put some money their way, some technology their way, and a peace treaty their way. If they don't accept it, then we're just going to have to get on with it, my friends, and do the best we can. It might, means, it might mean I might have to try and take Florida, which will increase my trade income, and try and go from there. But from there, from, but only then, my friends, can we try and get ourselves um, onto on both feet again. But anyway, we've got a chance to intercept here, which we're going to do. We're going to take this fight right off the bat. As you can see, we've got this sort of force here in Falmouth, which I did put into Falmouth. I sort of managed to sneak into Falmouth before the Prussians sort of just walked into Falmouth without even batting an eyelid. We do have these reinforcements here, luckily, and also we do have these gentlemen here as well as a backup. So I think that's what we'll do. We'll bring in this army first. We're going to have quite a tough fight here. This is a brand new, up-to-date, fully replenished army, and it's going to not going to be easy at all. Right? of my talking my friends let's get on with this fight I'm hoping that if we defeat this Prussian army and give them a good kicking uh, that that Prussian fleet might sort of move away in the end hopefully something back at home will bring the Prussians back to uh, Europe and it'll just free us up we've given them a good kick in they may just leave us alone if they don't I've got to start looking at other options which means Florida and sort of just accepting the fact that I can't break that siege the Prussians have put on me. They've got a lot of ships there. I don't have many ships. I've got one brand new um, sort of heavy ship coming my way. That's not going to be enough by itself. We are literally, my friends, at the mercy of the Prussians being moving away. If they don't move away, then I'm going to have to use some of my armies to go and try and take Florida out. It's as simple as that. The Cherokees, you know, gave Florida a good kick in. So there's a chance we might be able to get in there with a sort of a smaller force, but it's going to be tough. Um, I just can't put it any other way, my friends. This, uh, this, this might even come to an end. This whole campaign might come to an end because the Prussians have done that. That is one of those things you just got to accept, my friends. Sometimes when you start these campaigns, that something completely out of the blue will just come along and kick you really hard, and it just ends things when you don't expect it. So, 
But I won't give up. I will not give up. I'm not someone who gives up on anything, my friends, until the absolute every eventuality has been sort of exhausted. But we're going to give this Prussian army a damn good kicking now because they are not coming to our land and taking over what they want and then blockading our port and everything. What I will do is I will move my new ship in there if they move out and then I'll keep that fleet there forever. Anyway, let's have a look what we've got here. Right, we are pretty much trapped here and locked in this sort of town battle which I don't like at all. Is it any... Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. Look at this. What a beautiful spot here for this army. This is absolutely perfect. It's a long way away from their artillery. And I don't know when my reinforcements are going to come in. That's, that's the problem. Your reinforcements could come in at any angle at all. So I want to set up this army as if it's going to receive the reinforcements where we need them. So first thing I'm going to do is get my artillery set up on this sort of nicely raised hill here. It's pretty much perfect. Right by here, in between these two these two trees here. Let's bring that. Ah, oh, we got a carcass shot as well. Even better. So now we're going to be sat ready. Now we've got... We have got cavalry, which I would like to try and use as best I can. But look at this—we're trapped in this town. Town fighting is absolute, an, an absolute hell to fight in. It really is, my friends. Ooh, got diamond formation as well, even better. And we've got, ooh, we've got grenadiers. Grenadiers are going to actually hold the line here. Oh no 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 no! Gentlemen, please, let's have some proper discipline. We've only got sort of four regiments here. We've got to use them absolutely to their full potential. So we're going to sort of almost corner ourselves in here. Why is that happening? Why is that happening, my friends? Why, why, why? Perfect. Let's have some proper discipline here. Now, Let's move these horse. I'll move these here with the objective of moving them to here once this uh, deployment zone is ended. Now I've got to choose where I'm going to put these cavalry and that is going to be pretty vital to our hopes here as it were. Right, let's begin my friends. Oh god. Good grief, good grief, my friends. We've come right in behind them. This is unbelievable. This is going to get messy, my friends. It's going to get really messy. Gentlemen, proper line formations. Oh, the first Delaware. <laughs> 
What the blazes? Oh my gosh. Oh gosh, we've lost our first regiment here. The lads get out of there, yes. Content of Marines, they're wavering. Right, time for these to pay for their lives. Holy smokes. Let's get stuck in here, my friends. I think we can do some damage here. Steady, lads, steady. You hold that line there. Oh, they've buckled, they've buckled. Gentlemen, move up, please. Get out of here, lads. Come on. Come back to us. Come back to us here. Move it, gentlemen. Move. They've just, they've bolted, they've had enough. Oh, they've had enough as well. <clears throat> oh, they've come back. Yes. Please come back. No, they've gone. They've had enough. So we're going to position ourselves just here, my friends. Beautifully poised here. Ooh. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo.
absolutely beautiful. <clears throat> Gotta wait for these to show themselves. We wanna hit these hard. Oh, this is gonna be hopefully these are gonna buckle. These are gonna buckle real soon. Let's position ourselves nice and right here. Right oh. Come on, let's keep firing. Keep firing. We need. We need to keep these around to keep them in place. Absolutely butcher them. I want this to be a complete killing ground here. We've got the horse here. Oh yeah, I'm going to shatter these. No, not no, not no, no, no. Stop, gentlemen. Stop, 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 stop. I'm going to move these forward slightly just to keep myself a little bit of range on these. Let's move these up while these others are firing. We're going to. Keep the pressure on these all times. That's it, beautiful. And as these move in, we shall. Excuse any noise in the background, my friends. That is my dog who has decided to do his, of course, attention. Oh, look at that. Absolutely butchered. Keep the fire. That's what I'm talking about. Look at this. Oh my gosh, this is an absolute slaughter. Absolutely butchered. Oh, they're shattered, they're shattered. Hold, lads, hold there. Oh, look at this. We've got incoming fire from both angles here. Absolutely perfect. Just what they needed was a damn good hammering. Cease fire. Absolutely butcher these gentlemen. These grenadiers.
beautiful, my friends. Absolutely beautiful. Absolute. Yes. That. That's. That said to them, don't come to our territory again. That is what you're going to get. We've given them a damn good thrashing, my friends. Holy smokes. And that is what they needed. Those Prussians coming here. Landing on our soil, blockading our major trade port. No chance. We're going to give them an absolute hammering. And we lose. We lost 530 men. They lost almost all of their men. Oh, look at the long rifle, man. They were absolutely exceptional. I intend to rid myself of those. ASAP, we got nice of St. John. Let's have a look at Prussia. And actually, Prussia are doing amazingly well here in Europe. They have done exceptionally well. That is why they've just sort of taken this bold step here to try and take us out. Look at that, we're bankrupt and everything, my friends. It's tough, it's going to be tough. Mukhal Empire. Ooh, they've just taken a good chunk there back off the Marathans. Looks like the Mughal are back for good there, my friends. Oh, are they against the British as well? Looks like the British. I oh, know the British have still got that corner there. I thought I might have taken some off there, haven't they? The Ottomans. I don't think anybody's going to come to my aid this time. But we should be back in the money a little bit, only because we've lost men. It's going to be a tough couple of years, my friends. It's going to be an austerity-ridden couple of years here in the US. It really is. Portugal. Who I believe are fighting the Spanish, so it's pretty good for us actually we're holding the Spanish off at least. Russia. Uh, ooh, I, yes, I shall take that. You can indeed, madam, have that. 800 that we definitely could do with Spain oh boy oh god they've gone back into oh they've gone back into the whoa it's Sweden whoa Sweden that's of course cool. Sweden could could Sweden could Sweden help me no, they couldn't Sweden no Sweden won't help me because wasn't Sweden being blockaded by was it Russia I think they were being blockaded by Russia weren't they yeah they were Poland. I think it's a Punjab net last. Oh, Mamluks, beg your pardon, my friends. Now. Oh, God, we're still bankrupt. How is it? Oh, that's what we're going to get next turn. Because we've lost those men. So. Got a new leader, but we're bankrupt, basically. So. Oh, dear. Oh, dear, 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 me. Right, that is the that is those are gone. One nine. I almost got two thousand only because I've lost these men. Damn it! I'm not going to be in any shape at all. That oh my god, we're losing men here as well because of if Britain come for us, we're going to be in a world of hurt. Right, let's do what we can here, the best we can. Minus one morale to battles. Sorry, state here. If only the Cherokee would come along, I would help them in taking trying to take Florida. But sir, stealth is my cloak. 
nothing here so I need to push this gentleman where he's going to be useful and that is to Change here to position. rally <sighs> of course they've come with quite a sizable fleet here not one we're going to shift very easily we do have this here but that's not going to do us any good at all is it my friends <sighs> what if we can get try and get peace with Prussia now we've done Yes, 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 that might just have got us out of a hole. Wow. Would Spain, would Spain be willing to negotiate peace? I shall give them those two here for peace. Oh, fine, not a problem. And then looks like, my friends, we are in this for the long haul. We're stuck here behind this sort of barricade here. And we are we will be able to stabilize. I'll have to try and build my armies back up again. Research technology. Oh, one more for fire in advance. I need to do, do to get my 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 navy up as running as quickly as possible here. Couple bottoms. Carronades. County frigate with some oh, short range firepower. Ooh. Might be pretty useful. Right, I've got to try and do this. Wow, that is such a tight budget here. Hopefully with some more income from Britain coming in. What's the ministry like here for Treasury? Mm. Ooh, through whoa, man it took minus two, you must be joking. Okay. balanced out pretty... F no, I can leave it as it is. I'm not going to mess about with it too much. Let's end the turn, my friends. We need... I'm praying that Britain, st Britain starts war with us. We're going to be... We're going to be fighting on the back foot. Let's just put it that way. Ooh, hoo hoo. Now they've decided to pick a fight with the Mughal Empire. That could be rather difficult for them. Oh, come on, Cherokee nations. Come on, come to our help. Come to our aid. Nope, not today, you're not, by the looks of it. We're at Denmark. So they might be hitting the Barbary states there. Oh, France. Oh, do do do. <gasps> wow. Prussia. Oh. Don't do it, Prussia. Don't do it. Iroquois. That's a St. John. They're really keeping them pinned back. Whoa, 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 whoa. Rather Confederacy, an alliance. Why not? I need the money. I won't be helping them, the Martha and Confederacy, but I just need the money. If they were to disappear, then so be it. But if they do take the Mughal Empire out, then I have gained quite... Whoa, they've taken Britain. They have taken Britain out. Holy smokes, they've just taken all of this back from Britain. Wow. They don't like foreign invaders at all, do they? Wow, that is a heck of a time there, my friends. The whole of Europe is in absolute two months. So is the Indian continent as well. Wow, look at the look at the Ottomans. They've got vast amount of troops. The French are meant to be my allies, but of course they're not, they're not doing anything at all, really. At oh, Portugal.
pressure. Spain. Don't do anything city Spain. Don't do anything specific city. Don't do anything silly. No, Sweden. No. Ooh. Looks like Denmark has had a good kicking there. Sweden. Okay. Oh, Sweden are going for St. Petersburg. Holy smokes. And uh, Coland. And Mamluks are last. think so my friends I not know what whoa that two nine two six nine six I go I've just managed to get myself surplus here. I'm going to try just try and get peace with Prussia. Let's just throw some things in at them here. Two hundred nothing too fancy nothing too you know too excessive, but let's just sweeten the deal a little bit. Oh, okay, they really don't like us at all. So they're at war with pretty much everybody here in around them. Nietzsche, oh, the allies, oh, Russia. Let me just have a quick look around at what how they're doing. Yep, yeah, their empire has expanded exponentially fast here. I hope that oh, are they at, who are they at war with? Not a war with Austria, unfortunately. Oh, actually, they're allies with Austria. Damn it, that's a powerful confederation there. I wanted to check. Whoa, look at this. Ch the Ottomans have taken Chikask Ch here from the Russians. Wow. Oh and, oh, and they've taken Georgia as well. That is a staggering blow. Holy smokes. They really are pushing in. That's, that's a real surprise, that, because now they've got the back door here, head for Moscow. It's all over for Russia. Yeah, so our tax income is nine four six eight. Okay, I'm gonna slowly, slowly, slowly start to get these armies. Oh, look at that, 750. I'll have to do that just for get my income a bit better. I'm gonna slowly, my friends, begin to repair these armies. Just bit by bit. I'm going to start putting these armies back into one into one piece, as it were. Just like that, little bits here and there, but trying to also keep my money intact. I've got to do this by the absolute book. 3,082. So fifth rate, 165. I do need to build another fleet here, but I can't really afford to do. I've got to try and keep myself in a surplus in here, as it were. And well, they're just expanding exponentially here. These are wow, clamor for reform. If the Cherokees could come and help us, I would be eternally grateful to them. If they could try and hit this here, okay. What are we researching next? What? I can't build his army board, but there's no point yet. So I might as well put my research into increasing my produ productivity. I think I'm going to go for that. Five turns are going to 10% well from farms. So we, our farms are definitely going to start bringing in the money as well, which we definitely do need. Um, I have to keep that right at the end of the two, my friends. I'm on a knife edge here between war and...
and also between um, the finances. So I'm just juggling things around, especially with New York being out. Uh oh, uh oh, here we go. This is going to be the end. Britain's going to declare war on us. They're not picking up that army for nothing either. God, here we go. Here we go. This is it. Don't believe it. I don't believe it. Holy smokes, this is getting ridiculous. I just knew that Britain would do that. I just knew it. <sighs> oh God. Will the Cherokees help us? I don't know. I don't even know if they can. Will Spain even do anything? I don't know. Will Spain just sit, sit there and blockade me and, you know, not just not help at all? Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Trade Agreement, Military Alliance. Yes, please, good sir. Thank you very much. A trade agreement is definitely what I need. <sighs> Come on, Prussia, just leave us alone here. Just move away. Move away from our from that New York and I shall be a happy man. Nope. Still going to keep that firmly there. I've got to try and get peace with Prussia. I just have to. Yeah, they really have pushed on hard. What's key is what the Spanish will do. You may see the Ottoman Empire um, turn, remove there, my friends, because it did take quite a long time for them to do, to sort of go do in there, do their thing. So that, that, that bug is still there a little bit there, where it just sort of takes time, especially they've got individual units moving about, or a lot of them, should I say, then it does take quite a bit of time for them to do its move. Spain will be crucial here. If they go for Britain, we should be okay. But look at this. The Ottomans here are absolutely caving in the Russian Empire here bit by bit, which is a real sh Whoa! Which is a real shocker. That is just absolutely crazy. Hmm. Holy smokes. Look at that. 
Oh my gosh, that is a staggering army. They're going straight for there. I only got that one in reserve as well. Cheapest creepers, great balls of fire. I'm not joking, my friends. We are in a bit of trouble. Let's try and get some of these up and running here. I'll try and get some of these at least back up to full strength. we can here. We've got, luckily we've got trade partners here with France, who do still have Louisiana, whoa they've lost Upper Louisiana to the Iroquois. And Spain are just absolutely building a huge force here. If the Cherokee could come in, that would be a real help to us. Oh my god, down to 30 men here. We are taking an absolute battering. got to ignore the south for a bit. But this army here is repairing okay. But these gentlemen here, well they're soon going to be engaged in a fight to the death. Try to get this army up. This army is going to be the one that's going to fight us. But I just got. Why can't I just get pressure off my back? No, they just don't like us. It's just. Wow, they just really don't like us at all. War, different type, wow. Okay, looks like we're going to have this army. Wait a minute, I got these here. I forgot I got this army here. Holy smokes, I forgot about these. Doing too bad as I thought, actually. <laughs> oh, yes, indeed, my friends. I didn't think I was going to be too bad here, but I've got this army here, which I will definitely throw into the fight with the British. But that fleet is pretty much. Oh, they got a hideous victory. This fleet is pretty much invincible at the moment. And they got HMS Victory here as well. Holy smokes. That is a hell of a... I need to get these out of here. That's all I need is, is for this to be freed here. They're at war with Prussia. Why aren't they doing something about it? I don't know. And Russia is being hit pretty hard here. Wow, they've even taken Astrakhan as well. Prussia is stupidly powerful here. Um, maybe if France can take 
maybe if France can take the Netherlands it might strengthen them as well which means they might come to my aid but I'm not going to bank on it just yet anyway let's end the tour my friends and see what happens here I obviously can't get peace with any with Prussia yet I'm just banking on them moving out of the way if they can move out of that port I, oh god then I will be okay but oh my god here comes another oh dear oh dear Cherokee Nations, come and help your allies here. They need you. Nope, they're not going to be much use to us, so... there so s it looks like the U New York is going to be besieged for a long time yeah Italian states what will Russia do against the Ottomans that's the key Looks like Rome. Come on, Spain, go for Britain. Don't bother with us, we're just the small fries. Leave us alone. Leave us alone. Yes, that's more like it. Oh. Still don't leave us alone. I'm going to go for that. I'm going to kick that one in. Ooh, St. Petersburg's in danger. Ooh. Wow, Boston Bay, New South Wales, wow. Okay, so what have we got landed here? We've got this here. Now what's he what is here though? I'm going to try and take that out and clear the port. I'm going to bring this gentleman into the fight. Yes! I'm going to take the money. Yes, yes, yes. Thank you very much, good sir. Well, uh, ooh, do, 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 do. That's going to cost me a fair old chunk of cash there. But, but, my friends, we can at least get ourselves prepared. We're going to put this army up to full spec again. doing too bad. That's enough to hold off this and give it a real good... I've got to try and get these armies back up to full. Oh, I'm not going to yield my friends at all. Not at all. Oh yes, I can get this army up to full spec now. That's going to be quite a nice little force there once it's gone. So if Britain comes in here... How long could it last, I wonder? It's probably about four turns. So we're looking probably about... I can hold for about four turns. That's going to give me enough time for these armies here to be fully repatriated with troops. Apart from these gentlemen here which is going to cost me a good chunk of money 
but at least I'll be having the bulk of it ready to go especially the ground forces and I've got that 477 um, that means the Spanish have to come along with quite a large chunk of an uh, of a fleet to take this to cut this off again can I finally get peace with Prussia no can't go in the first fleet gift just yet technology rights of man payments offer a payment of one hundred no okay well Britain can we get peace with Britain peace technology oh yes indeed we do have some things that you just might like here New York free not so that's what they're after they're after New York <laughs> that's their target is it fair enough oh, I'll soon have enough of a tr enough troops here these are going to be landed somewhere as well that's why I've got to get my troops up to full spec as quickly as possible these will probably be able to hold this army here for quite a while actually longer than I would expect them to okay this will be probably my last turn my friends I know we've got one massive battle but I'm just got to try and get this you watch a fleet turn up and pick up these troops you just watch there it is I knew it was coming there it is we can hold there, we can hold for a bit Ooh. damn they're hitting them hard oh believe it French. Come on, Cherokee nations, you can help us. No, you can't because you're not going to help us at all. like you wouldn't believe wow okay so boy Portugal Persia, Spain, La Spania. Don't do it, Spain. Don't do it. Oh, thank goodness. Wow. Siege. Oh god, one turn till surrender. Holy smokes. 477, right. First thing we're going to do is I'm going excuse me my friends, I'm going to move th this Jamaica right around and we're going to put it in, in here. Ah, that should give us a little bit of oomph there. Falmouth's busy. This could fall in one go, which I'm not going to allow it to happen. So, 
So what have we got here? Oh, these are almost done. These are so close to being done here. Let's not panic yet, my friends. Let's not just not panic just yet. Let's just keep things in perspective. here so that's back up to full these are getting up the oh, this one's going to full 104 here I could give this army a damn good thrashing here I could hit it really hard for the next turn and allow this army to replenish and then go into battle here let's do that that's it my friends, we've got to get this army up to full we need to have a full a full army here, 3979 ok, and this army is going to be up as well, pretty near to where we need it to be so if I just patience my friends, patience I need what I'm going to do is I'm going to sort a fourth with this army I've got here, try and do as much damage to this like, as I can oh damn that's a lot of troops, that is a, they got the f grenadiers Hessel Castle Grenadiers, Hessian Grenadiers, they've got so many troops here, this is going to be scary as hell. But I've got, what I've got to do is use this army here to try and do as much damage to this British army. And then once these are fully replenished, which they will be in a couple of turns time, I can then go and move out and absolutely crush this army once and for all. And also this army here will be fully replenished and I'll be able, I'll be ready to repel anything that comes out unless I just move to here. Now once I move out, I'll have this army backing it up. So let's take these off here so I've got the money coming in from this. There's no point in spending money on troops that are going to get battered in a battle. And that's going to give me enough here to replace all these. That's my army, that's my real army i got here. This army is my secondary army. <clears throat> okay, let's do this. Right, it's going to be a tough, tough couple of turns. So what I need to do is start recruiting some more oh, Pennsylvania rifles. Okay, we're going to start recruiting here in Philadelphia. And we're going to come out from our fort here. We're going to give the British a bloody nose. And that, my friends, is going to be our next battle next episode. I am sorry, my friends, for any of the Ottoman turns being quite slow, but unfortunately that bug is still there. But, my friends, this is the battle we're going to have next turn, and I'm, I've got confidence in my troops. I've got confidence in my troops that we can actually do this, my friends. We are not up against any heavy cavalry, mostly just native cavalry and some dragoons. And also they've got a good spattering of light infantry, a lot of light infantry is actually making up the bulk of their forces, they do have quite, but we've got, we should have more than enough here to be able to deal quite damage to this army here and give it a really good thrashing. We've then got this really powerful army here in Boston, it's going to be fully replenished, that is then going to be the army that's going to kick anything that comes this way from the British, we can then replenish and repair any of these armies that, uh, these units that are left from the battle. And then we can start rebuilding, my friends. Now we've got New York back from the Prussians. We can start rebuilding our armies again. I might even have to combine what's left of this with this army here. Make it into two. I'll have two powerful armies here in, this, in the north. I'll try and replenish my army down in the south, especially with the Spanish. But, my friends, we have just about weathered the storm so far, but only so far. And we're going to take the fight next turn, my friends. But I hope you've enjoyed it. If you have, please comment, like, and subscribe. I can promise you a huge battle next turn, my friends. But until next time, my friends, hope you've had a good week so far. But until next time, my friends, when well, I can promise you, well, 
quite an episode. Please keep your comments coming. Please let me know what you should do. Please comment, like, and subscribe if you enjoy this video. Until then, my friends, bye for now.